Hi, this is Roger. Thanks for dropping by. This is just a video to let you know what's going on, really, and why there haven't been videos and won't be for a while yet. Um, yesterday I gathered a few plants together and took them over to the collection point where all the guys were dressing the pots and staking stuff and, you know, getting them into sets, all that sort of stuff. <laughs> and um, I was asked if I had any more because they were desperate. And I said, what stage are you at? Is it anything with a bloom on? And he said, not far off that, really. <laughs> um, so I explained that I did have some more and um, dealt with a bit of the work going on and then did a rush back to the house and gathered more plants. So there's quite a bit missing now. <coughs> um, <coughs> they've got my wedding bell, the big yellow dendrobium, and the Friedrichsianum, the, the mounted yellow one. They've also got my Miltonioxis, the yellow one. Um, they've got my Infundibulum cross, the white dendrobium. They've got the Coneco, the purple one. So that's gone. Um, the Shelob Tolkien's gone. So there's quite a bit of what was in bloom now missing, and it'll be missing till next week when I can get them back, Monday. Um, and talking of missing, I'll be missing. I'm traveling up to Malvern today, so this will be the last video until I get back literally. Um, uh, that's the way it will be. Um, I'm hoping to um, have internet access on my laptop at the hotel so I should be able to keep my eye on the Facebook group otherwise I'm going to end up with a shed load of posts all queued up ready to go. Um, so I should be able to do that but I can't guarantee it. Um, and yeah that's about it really. Um, <clears throat> Travelling up today, um, travelling back Sunday morning and then Sunday afternoon I've got to take my daughter home. She's orchid and cat sitting for me. Um, so that's the sort of state of play at the moment. Um, my terrestrial orchid, my outside orchid as I call it, it's actually a leopard marsh orchid. You can look it up if you want to see what it looks like. But the, the name leopard orchid, uh, marsh orchid, um, is a variety of the southern marsh orchid, I believe, and the leopard variety relates to the markings on the leaves. It's got nothing to do with the blooms, um, so it's a leaf variation, and it's got the like the rings that you see on the patterns on you know on a leopard. Um, I was going to take that, but by some sort of miracle, I've got seedlings growing in the pot. It's managed to self-seed. Um, so I was very reluctant to let them have that because when they dressed the pot they'd probably damage the seedlings. <clears throat> and in addition to that we have one specialist grower at Bournemouth Orchid Society that mainly grows terrestrials and it is their season at the moment and he's, he's put loads into the display. Personally I find them boring. Um, and when you're thinking of a display for the public that are not necessarily orchidy people those are quite uninteresting, although some of them might think, oh, we've got some of those on the hills near us, you know, something like that. But anyway, they've got an awful lot of Phalaenopsis in the display. Um, but if you think about that, for the general public, that's probably what they like to see, because that's what they know. So I don't know what our display is going to be like. I'll find, I'll find out Friday morning when I get there. Um, but uh, yeah, so that, that's what's going on. Um, anybody who's going to Malvern that wants to come and say hello, I'll be there all day Friday and all day Saturday, not on Sunday. Um, it'd be easy enough to find the Bournemouth Orchid Society display around the outside somewhere. Um, there'll be a big separate stand to our display in memory of Keith Andrew, our president that passed away recently. So there's a big display um, for him, you know, a sort of memorial display. Um, but all the um, show committee and the people, Orchid Society people from Bournemouth Orchid Society will have their tops on, which are dark blue with a red logo with Bournemouth Orchid Society written on it. <laughs> well, what else would you have written on it? Um, so if, I'm, if you can't find me, just ask one of them. They'll know where I am. I mean, I'm generally going to be hanging around the marquee anyway, so I'll be around. But if you want to come and say hello, please do so. Introduce yourself. And um, we'll go from there. So this is just a video, really, to let you know what's going on and um, 
why there aren't any videos for a bit. <laughs> uh, it's the only time of year this really happens, you know, but uh, so be it. And uh, I'll see you in the next video whenever that might be. Bye for now.